Grateful for it is your claim that the defendant, who used to be your girlfriend, damaged your front door in an incident that occurred when? Yes, ma'am, on March the 1st, early morning March. What time? Around 1 o'clock. How long hadn't you been a couple? Around six months, around that time. Did you ever live together? No, not live together. She stayed a couple of nights here and there, but not officially living together. And the relationship terminated when? On the 1st, actually. 1st of? Of March, I'm sorry. Oh, I thought you said it was over six months before. Oh, no, we were in a relationship up until Four, that time. six months? Yes, ma'am. So the relationship terminated on March the 1st? Yes, ma'am. And this incident happened on March the 1st? Yes, ma'am. So it happened during the day? The day before, on February 29th, we got into a big argument. And that night, I told her that I didn't want to see her again, and uh, I would give her... Some Where did that happen? That was at my house. Okay. All right, and I told her I didn't want to see her again, and I sent her a text saying that I can meet her and give her her stuff, and uh, if she came back over to my house, that I would call the cops. So what you did was tell her, if I'm getting this right, you would meet her someplace else. Yes, ma'am. To give her her things. What things did you have? I had her laptop, and maybe she left some clothes over there. Do you have that text? Yes, ma'am. I'd like to take a look at it. How do you make this go up and down? Ma'am, it was just a screenshot. Why? Well, it was only pertaining to that time in question of that she never responded back. You say in the last part of this text that if you ever show up here again, I will call the police. You want to tell me why you made that statement to her? Well, Alexis sometimes is unpredictable, so I just didn't want any trouble, so instead I just wanted to meet her in a neutral place. And no, I understand her. that. Yes. But you used the word again. Well... If she... you come over here again... Right. Had she come over there and created a scene before? Yes, she has before, but not in reference to this situation. This time, we had got into the confrontation originally at my house, and then it just continued from there. From there to what? From when she left, she was at home, and we were texting each other back and forth or, you know, talking to each other on the phone. So I just didn't want her to come back to my house again. Well, that's why I would have liked to have seen the texting back and forth, not just a screenshot. Do you have the texting back and forth, Ms. Powers? No, ma'am. I don't have that, the text messages back and forth because my phone was off when he sent that message, and he knows it. So there are no response to those texts. I didn't have a working phone, and the phone I had before we got here was destroyed, so I don't have that. You know, everybody comes here. It's really so odd. <laughs> Bird, I have these cellular phones, these phones. Mm -hmm. And while I have replaced them periodically, like once every seven or eight years, they never get destroyed. You know how many people stand there and say, my phone got destroyed, it was run over by a truck, it fell in the lake, Mom I would have had the wall. evidence, I would have had the evidence. You know, how old are you? 23. Your phone is never off. Oh, no, ma'am. Oh, no, your phone is never off. I have a whole bunch of 23-year-old grandchildren. Their phone is their appendage. And they, they would sooner lose a limb than turn their phone off. Okay, so she came over to your house the morning of the 1st of March, yes, 1 a.m. Yes, ma'am. And what happened? Well, I heard a loud banging on my bedroom window, and it sounded like somebody was going to break in. And I heard my daughter scream. So the first thing I did was grab the weapon, and I went to the window. And when I went to the window, I saw that it was Alexis. And I told her that I was going to call the cops. She came around to the front door, and she still kept banging, like trying to come in, but she was knocking so hard or kicking that I felt like she was gonna kick the door off the hinges. And that's almost what happened. My brother here, he lives with me, and he can witness that. Uh, we had to hold the door so she wouldn't kick it off the hinges while I was on the phone with the dispatch. You have photographs of the door? Yes, ma'am. I'd like to see them. Did the police arrive? Yes, ma'am. You have a report? I have an incident report. Yes, I'd like yes. to see them. All are arguing with a female. Female trying to break a window and kick the door down. Do you own this house, sir? Yes, ma'am. Now, how long did you have your phone off? My phone was off for about a week or so. Okay. 